Hello everyone, welcome back to another session in Dentistry MO. Today we have a small topic in human anatomy that is circle of Willis. Circle of Willis, uh, it is a commonly asked short note in university exams. So as the picture says, it is a anastomotic ring of arteries which is seen in brain. So let's get into details of circle of Willis. So circle of Willis, it is also known as cerebral arterial circle or circulus arteriosus. So cerebral arterial circle or circulus arteriosus. It is the anastomotic ring of arteries located at the base of the brain. This arterial anastomotic circle which connects the two major arterial systems to the brain that is the internal carotid arteries internal carotid arteries and the vertebro basilar system so this is vertebral artery and this is a basilar artery so it connects two system that is internal carotid arteries and the vertebro basilar systems and it is formed by four paired vessels and a single unpaired vessel with numerous branches that supply the brain. So let's see the arteries from anterior to posterior. So the paired arteries are anterior cerebellar artery. We have two arteries left and right and the unpaired artery is anterior communicating artery so this is the anterior communicating artery which is an unpaired one so anterior cerebellar artery is a paired one we have right and left then internal carotid artery we have left and right which is also paired posterior cerebellar artery so posterior cerebellar artery is here this also we have paired left and right and posterior communicating artery again we have right and left okay so anterior cerebellar artery internal carotid artery posterior cerebellar artery posterior communicating artery are the paired arteries and anterior communicating artery is a unpaired artery so these forms a circle which is known as circle of willis the middle cerebral artery so the middle cerebral arteries uh, they actually supply the brain but are not considered part of circle of willis and also we have various other arteries like basilar artery superior cerebellar artery anterior inferior cerebellar artery posterior inferior cerebellar artery vertebral artery but circle of willis has these arteries that means four paired arteries and one unpaired arteries okay so what is the main function of circle of willis so circle of willis is to provide a collateral blood flow between the anterior and posterior arterial system of brain okay so it is to provide a collateral blood flow between anterior and posterior arterial systems of brain in addition to that it offers the alternate blood flow pathways between the right and left cerebral hemispheres it provides a alternate blood flow pathway between right and left cerebral hemispheres so this way the circle protects the brain from ischemia and stroke in cases of vascular obstruction or damage so this circle provides uh, the alternate blood flow pathway to right and left hemisphere so it can prevent the arterial uh, problems such as ischemia and stroke when there is uh, vascular obstruction or damage happens in the any of the arterial system so I discussed about uh, the components of circle of willis and its function and circle of willis uh, which is named after uh, English physician Thomas 
Willis. So, so the circle of Willis uh, allows blood to flow across the midline of the brain if an artery on one side is occluded and the circle of Willis thereby serves a safety valve function for the brain allowing collateral circulation or flow of blood through an alternate route to take place if the flow is reduced one area. So this is a mechanism, a safety valve mechanism which is seen uh, inside the arteries of brain. So that's about a circle of Willis which is having four pairs of artery and one unpaired artery. So anterior cerebellar artery, internal carotid artery, posterior communicating and posterior cerebellar artery are the paired arteries and anterior communicating artery is unpaired one. Middle cerebral artery is not uh, part of this circle. So this is actually the circle of Willis. So don't get confused. So this is the circle of Willis. Okay, circle of Willis. So, it is an important question uh, frequently asked in university exam as a short note. So, you need to draw the diagram and mark the five arteries and write about its two or three functions that is, the safety valve mechanism and helps in ischemia and the stroke. So I'll come up with a new topic in anatomy. Thank you.